Hello ladies and gentlemen and welcome back to the channel. Today we are looking at Tangai Nianzu in our Wonder Kid watch. Uh, the player, the French centre half, 18 years old, um, came from PSG to Germany to join up with FC Bayern. Uh, currently playing for the second team in the third Liga in Germany. Um, looks very well rounded for an 18 year old centre half. Already listed for loan so we may see him go out on loan in the next five years. To, to help his development. £33,000 a week is quite a lot for a centre half um, of 18 years of age, but obviously they see something in him. Six foot two years old, two years old, six foot two in height, <laughs> 15 heading, which is his best attribute by far, um, but looks a very, very good player to start with, and certainly one that should be able to develop. Um, let's jump ahead, see where he's at, and go from there. So we are five years on, 23 years old now, valued at £20 million, played 31 times for the under-21s of France. Um, some big stats here, so you can see he's very quick, 17 pace, physicals are looking incredible for 23, 16 strength, 16 stamina, 17 pace, 16 natural fitness, 17 jumping reach, 16 balance, and then even agility and acceleration are, are very high as well. Headings obviously improved even more, passing, tackling, very, very good. A player that can definitely be a bit more, even more of a cover player for um, a team, so sweeping up behind the defensive line. Um, doesn't look like he did get loaned out in the end, um, stuck around at the by in the second team didn't do amazingly well um, but has started to play a few more games for Bayern's first team now uh, five games in the first year getting a 6.78 rating which isn't great but um, season after 10 appearances one goal 7.18 rating definitely an improvement um, on that front uh, milestones while he's he did win the the championship we're in the third league with the Bayern second team uh, isn't too much of a surprise but Quality he's showing is very, very nice. Um, I'm, I'm looking forward to jumping ahead again, um, see him in his prime, see where he's at and how that's gone for him. And hopefully he'll be getting a bit more game time. So he's moved on to Liverpool following, it looks like a move to Leipzig as well. So it'll be interesting to see how that's panned out. Still looking very athletic. Um, mentals are looking okay. Uh, and technicals, again, still looking pretty good. Looks like he can play in a few positions, maybe because of that pace. That he's been used as a bit more of a utility player, but now at Liverpool, um, hasn't played for France, which is a bit of a surprise with the quality he's got. Um, but we can see that he he didn't play as much for Bayern. Um, moved to Leipzig, which where again he's not played actually that much. When he did play, he seems to do okay. Um, but again with Liverpool, forty two. Am I mad in thinking that this is ridiculous money for a player that hasn't played? <laughs> the most he's played is for Bayern's second team in the third Liga. And then since becoming professional in the Bundesliga, he's played... Let me just work this out quickly. He's played 36 games. He's 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 played 36 games in how many seasons? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. In nine seasons, he's played 36 games. And he's £73 million has been spent on him. I mean, he's a good player, so I don't understand why he's not being played. But what? It's I'm, I'm amazed by that. That's that's really shocked me to see. Um, has he won anything? I mean, it's not much of a win if he has. Doesn't look like it. He's not even won anything during that time. So, we'll, well, we'll jump again because I I want to see where he's at and if he actually played any more games. Um, but yeah, we'll we'll see in five years. All right, so he has moved on now um, from Liverpool. Only played three get times for Liverpool. Uh, obviously, physicals have gone down, but still looking pretty good. Uh, again, with technicals, not bad really for, for a 33-year-old. Never Hasn't made an appearance for France. Can't imagine that's going to be likely now. Um, likely be the reason for that is because he just doesn't play. He hasn't played at all. Moved to Salzburg, which meant he actually got game time and showed a bit of ability uh, for 15.5 million, which was nice to see. Uh, and then now off to Lazio, um, where he's played a bit as well. Finally, he's getting actually some game time um, and his price is obviously shot down. I, I just can't believe that Leipzig and Liverpool both spent that much money. Um, I get Leipzig, but he just didn't play. 
And then going on to Liverpool and not playing as well is a bit of a shame. But it's nice to see you got to went off to Salzburg, managed to play a good few seasons there, um, and and then obviously to Lazio for eight million. Um, seems like he did win uh, a couple of titles with Salzburg in Austria, so the FA Cup, the Premier Division, um, a couple of times each for them. So. He has got some trophies to his name, even if he is in a lesser league. But it's fine. It is good to see that he has been able to to kind of play at all, um, which is because it's a shock to see such a good player not play at all or even want to play. Um, strangely, maybe that's the professional trait he's got. Um, if he was a bit more demanding, maybe he'd have moved on a bit quicker. But he's obviously quite professional, so happy to do what he needs for the team. But we'll jump again to see where he's at when he retires and how that's gone. Okay, so a retirement at the age of 36. As we know, he didn't get to make any appearances for France's national team. Um, he moved on from Lazio after playing 26 games to Blackburn for a season, where he only played one game, making a move to CSK Moscow, uh, making 22 appearances there as well. Uh, so he didn't. He made. He got eight winners' medals by the looks of things. Um, in total, uh, 268 appearances though over his career, which is a bit of a shame, really. Uh, I think the lack of he never made over 100 appearances for any club. The closest he came was FC Bayern's second team, um, which isn't great. But I mean, he's a good player. Just play him. That's my suggestion. If you if you have him in your team, I'd give him game time, and I'm sure he could develop even further. He's obviously wanted by some big clubs and. Costs quite a bit by the looks of things, but st still a team, if you can get him in playing, there's no reason why he couldn't become a very, very good player for you. But uh, I hope you did enjoy. Thank you very much for watching. Uh, like, subscribe and all that good stuff. And I will catch you next time.